Hello everybody, Shaz and I made here, and today I am back with Raft, uh, creative. Oh crap. Bah. Okay, that was not supposed to happen. Uh, I've been working a lot on off-camera, because I got very, very bored. Uh, I'll show you what I did here with the Siddle Tower in a sec, but I first want to show you these three boats. Uh, I also built this zip line. You saw the, me build the zip line too here. And I just built one back because it was exhausting having to walk all the way back. And it was really nice to have a and it's really nice to have a way back here. So now I have that. I painted the floorboards here with my YouTube logo because uh, it could. Uh, sorry, it's not perfectly centered. Uh, I I could have I should have built it out, uh, but I didn't plan to build it this way. So uh, yeah, I just kind of did that. I'm gonna, so I built that one first, I'm gonna go over to that one, which is, that one's actually a smaller version of something I built in a different world. Uh, it's a smaller warship of a warship I built. Uh, but all of these here are ships with specific features, and, uh, yeah, they're pretty cool, but, uh, yeah. Why, why did I do that? I don't know. I'll figure it out. I forgot to reinforce the floor floorboards of this, didn't I? Okay, um, I'll just do this as I head up. Uh, this is incomplete. I never completed the interior, and the only way in is through that. Uh, is through the this through where the anchor sits. Uh, my other one of these is much longer, and I think a few bits wider. Uh, it was back when I was testing Warship's concept. Uh, yeah. When I came up with this, something very similar to this, and I built it. And, uh, it turned out really well, so I brought it into this world. So this is the Enforcer Battleship. Uh, this is, like, literally the same model. It even has this little outcrop here. The only difference is that since it's longer, I can actually put the doors correctly. Uh, this one does not have a functioning radar. I sort of built it that way, but on the actual... I'll, I'll just show you the actual one later, but... They're really close together, and I just built that. Uh, you're not supposed to come up here, but I just built that so I could come up here. Uh, here are the cool things, though. Uh, let me get some fireworks here. These are the turrets, quote-unquote. I'm just gonna get 50. Basically, if war sh if ships are having a war, they're just gonna shoot fireworks at each other. And I have two turrets here. And these other ones that are like this, these are alert rockets. So they fire straight up into the air. And explode. Whereas, if you fire them up straight on this, they have a arc. But if you place one down, and here, let me, sh I'll even show it you. You can see that one in was intersecting with it. And no matter what you do, you cannot get those to not intersect like that. But yeah, that pretty much shows off this warship. I'm gonna go to bed quickly. Hi, shark. Uh, pretty much everything else is the same, though, except for the Siddle Tower, which I'll get to in a minute here. Um, main, the main reason I'm on the world is because I'm trying to fill up all the fuel tanks so then I can build the engine. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a connecting piece to all of these things here so that they're connected. Uh, but yeah, let's just go over the Siddle Tower quickly. So originally, these room, this was door was not here. I put it there because I was so annoyed with having to walk all the way around. 
but this did not have a roof. This now has a massive roof area. That is flipping amazing. You can walk around up there. Well, not... Uh, if you're on watch, you can walk around up there. But if you're not, you can't. Uh, oh god, I have to go all the way around, don't I? Why did Platinum design it like this? I'm also, there are like no light up here, so I'm gonna get some torches. Where are the torches? Oh yeah, they're in here, aren't they? Uh, same thing go goes for here, though. I don't know why this one is so much dimmer. Like, they should be... It should be very lit up here. In here. I don't know why it's not. One of my favorite things about this is the fact that you can uh, fool people with this. So they walk up to it and they're like... Wait, what? These doors are broken. And they won't think of walking into it. I did it. I literally did that when I first came here. Both the doors were open. I was so confused. And I tried to open them. I spent like 10 minutes trying to open them and I couldn't. And then back here we got the closet. I There are just like a little, like a literal bunch of just like cells back there for uh, holding people. Oh yeah, right. Because we have this middle pathway, don't we? Yeah. I've also survived 45 days. So, yay. Then we get to the... Uh, lower bridge. Uh, I still need to fill this area in with stuff, and right under there would be where the prison cells are. But yeah. I also still need to narrow out the front of this with platinum. Uh, but this is just an update video. I'm not going to be doing anything crazy because uh, I didn't get any videos. Uh, many, uh, as much videos up as I wanted to. We got the radar. Then we've got the main captain area. And here is where I went out to build. So, a uh, lot of firework rockets out here, you're going to notice. Up here, this all used to be open, and I would be literally had fun. If I had, if I would have walked off of this, I would have fallen right into the... Uh, let me go over to this one. Uh, this one also has a roof. I don't know why. This roof is one piece smaller, and it annoys me. Because me and Platinum measured it like five, ten times. And, uh, we should have gotten it directly in the center. Uh, here's the area you can look down from. It's, honestly, it's more because I couldn't figure out how to get a- how to get a platform piece down here. Wait, can I get one down now? I don't think I can. Yeah, I still can't. But it was such a problem that I just was like, yep, I'm putting something there. And then, of course, you've got a top piece up here. And that's where the zip line connects. And I'm gonna put an extra little lamp here. Because I can. Anyways, uh. So these next. So you already saw the warship, which is supposed to have a crew of five. A uh, captain, navigator, or, well. A warship, the functional version of this would supposed to, would supposed to be of a crew crew of five. When I show you the one I built, uh, that one's supposed to have like a crew of like twenty. But uh, sh uh, I know I built these things. That's just a houseboat. That's literally just a houseboat. I built that because I thought people would want to have a houseboat. Th that's the same thing here. This is a farm boat. It's literally a, like a portable farm. Uh, with animals and stuff, and it has uh, it's a crew of one person here. I really like this, like, sun deck area. Although it's a pain if it's raining. And then there's so many animals up in here. And then if we go over here, there aren't any more animals. Yeah. I wasn't gonna let them out. And then we have the uh, top deck, which is just a really cool view, I guess. Uh... Then we've got a houseboat. Literally, this bottom floor is completely empty. Uh, if someone ever actually takes this over, or if I ever get another friend with raft, I will give them this boat, most likely. 
and I will say you can build as much as you want on the inside, just you can't build any more because I spent for freaking ever. It has its own radar station and everything, and it has a crap ton of batteries, and yes, I spent time getting those. No, I didn't. It's creative mode. I didn't have to spend time doing anything. Uh, then we've got this area here, which is the crew area. This can be operated by a crew of four people. This is more of like, literally, I built this for like a family, so like, it, it doesn't have- Oh, flip, I forgot one thing. I forgot the most important thing. Oh, I guess I'll, I've got two things here, give me a sec. Wait, I'm so confused. I'm, like, literally have gone- been on and off this boat, like, one time. Uh, you might be wondering why the floor is a different color, because it was originally a, like a completely white boat and it looked absolutely disgusting, so I changed it. There we go, there we go, now we got the barbecue on the back deck. That's, that's so much better. And then here I'm just gonna put like a crappy little fence. Crappy little gate. There, perfect. Uh, yeah. I'm also gonna put, like, a cooking pot and stuff in here. Uh, that's just a storage closet. There's nothing in there. And I will open it in a minute here to prove it. Uh, I'm just gonna give him basic, some basic crap. Second grill, just in case the, uh, other one magically falls off. Uh my first small gear rail thing and a water purifier actually wait actually wait i got an idea uh i need a storage container because i'm just gonna give this to someone i'm just gonna pack up all this i also found out that the other purifiers are much more annoying to set up than the simple purifiers so i'm just sticking with simple oh, that does not fit though dang it i'm so dumb Furniture later on. Yay. But yeah, that's pretty much all that I've done uh, aside from produce lots and lots of fuel. Like, so much fuel. Oh, I also added that little thing on top of my house. But uh, yeah, that's just like an extra storage area. I can put stuff up there. I can get up there. I figured out how to do parkour in this game. Did I not? Oh, God, I'm so dumb. I was, uh, I thought I had turned all of these on. I literally thought I had turned all, every single one of these on. And I'm so dumb, because I, because I didn't. Uh, I also need to fill up more of those. If you're wondering what the full tanks are, yeah. Also, if you're wondering what the fuel pipeline looks like, I really want to put, like, a crappy, like, just a lazy thing on top of this. And I'm going to later, but not now. Uh, then if we head up here, this is just the easiest, the quickest way to the roof. You know, you probably could have just jumped down here. Yep, that's what I was doing. And then here's the main fuel refinery, which is where I, well, the secondary fuel refinery, but I've been taking all, but I'm, all the fuel containers on this level are completely full. So, and I've got enough to fill up. With just one of these, I've got enough to fill up four, uh... Yeah, I've got enough to fill up four of these big tanks behind me. And then this process just takes forever, so I'll be back whenever that's done. Uh, all of those are full, by the way. So, yes, I can fill them up extremely quickly. I'll be back whenever I'm done. That's... This is just gonna be boring. Okay, I'm back. What did I just... Oh, I opened up my drawing tablet thing. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna kinda chill. Uh, if you guys think of anything I should add to my raft, uh, tell me. Like, go right ahead, I do not care.
Uh, once these are all turned on, I don't know what they're gonna do, but I know I'm gonna need all of my fuel on full. And with 16 of these, I should be able to fill up a big amount of those. I keep forgetting that the door is up here. They're already full? Wow. And then each of these gives me enough to fill up two. So... Full, 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 full. Empty. There we go. There we go. And boom. We've got almost near as much fuel as I want. You're probably wondering why I have not activated those. Uh, if I want to activate those ones in the back, I'm going to need at least... Uh, I'm going to need two, another person with me working on this. So I'm going to need Platinum, and Platinum's been busy lately, so, yeah. I'm going to force you guys to sit through me filling eight of these, so now you guys know how much it hurts to fill 16 of them, and how... Uh, I think there are 20 in here. Maybe they're just... I think there may be just 16. Wait. 8, 9, 10. There are 23, apparently. I don't know why there are 23, but there are 23. I may have miscounted. Whatever, I'll figure it out. But this has literally become my boring daily routine. It's just fill up all the fuel, let it make the fuel, and then sleep. It's not exciting, to say the least. Um, which is why I started building it first off, because I was so bored, but I wanted to get the ship moving, and now I've built these other big ships too, and that's really cool that I've gotten the chance to do this, so thank you guys, thank you to those of you who watch my videos. guys really help out and you guys really make my day and yes I'm gonna start constructing these temporary things to believe that this is what it started as is it started as that now it's this crazy mega raft now 
uh, you're wondering why I'm building this, I want to have like a temporarily safe area. So if we start moving, I can tell if we're actually moving. Let me get an anchor. And yes, I am getting a cheap throwable anchor. This will be the first cheap anchor on this sir, on this uh, world. And that's not a joke. There it goes, the first cheap anchor. And all the rest of these are really nice anchors, but that's the cheap one. Yes, I have been harvesting my strawberries more lately. I just... yeah. This is literally like my entire day. It's just this. It's so boring. But I'm hoping it will pay off. I really need to get platinum back on. Oh, I could go fishing some more. Yeah, see, this is uh, just storage area. I could go fishing more. No. I spent like an hour fishing. I'm not spending more time fishing. I'm done. Why did I leave this one? I don't know. If I left it raw, there was a reason I left it raw. Uh, yeah. So thank you for watching this little update video. That's pretty much all that's been going on. Uh, thank you so very much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share if you want. I will see you guys all in the next one. Ciao, snipe it out. Bye.